commonly known as Bitter Leaf or Onubu in Igbo land. It has several nutritional, vitamin, mineral, and medicinal benefits for poultry and livestock animals. In fact, the ones I planted in my farm, I battle with cattles on a daily basis. Cattles come there to feed because it has a lot of mineral and vitamins for them. They don't even allow us to even have access to it. In this particular content, relax and listen to all the values of this particular plant. If by now you have not subscribed to this channel or you are not following us in any of our handles, click the right button right now and do that. Now that you have clicked it, make sure you activate the notification bell so that anytime we release any of our interesting topic, you will be among the first that will get this value. Please, last, watch this content to the end. Don't skip any track at all so that you will not mix the value for this particular content. Now, let me give you the nutritional value of cedar acuta leaf. This leaf is very rich in protein, fiber, and carbohydrate, which can serve as a valuable source of nutrition for animals, poultry, uh, both four-legged and feathered animals, including aquaculture. Cedar acuta is very good for fish farmers. If you want to know more about that, if you're a fish farmer, drop the comment. On the comment section, I will guide you more on it. I don't want this video to be too long. That's why I will not extend it to aquaculture. Vitamins. Cedar acuta leaves contains vitamins such as vitamin A, vitamin C, and vitamin E. Vitamin A is very important for vision and immune function. Vitamin C is an antioxidant and that supports the immune system. And vitamin E is very important for muscle, health, and immune function also. It has minerals. Cedar acuta leaves have strong minerals like calcium, iron, magnesium, potassium, and the rest of them. These minerals are essential for bone health, muscle function, and at the same time overall health system, strengthening their health system and their immune structure. It has medicinal value. Cedar acuta leaves are known for their medicinal properties. They are believed to have anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, and the antioxidant effects, which can help in preventing diseases and promoting overall health in poultry and livestock animals. Additionally, cedar acuta is used in traditional medicine to treat various ailments in both human and animals, which you all know. Digestive health. Cedar acuta leaves are also believed to have digestive benefits, including promoting gut health and potentially helping to alleviate digestive issues in poultry and livestock animals. Immune support system. It is very, very clear, and studies have found this acceptable and generally agreed that cedar acuta leaves have immune boosting effects, which can help animals stay healthy. And resist infections and diseases. It is important to note that whilst the acuta leaves have potential and nutritional and medicinal benefits, they should be used in moderation under the guidance of a veterinarian or a poultry expert because excess consumption may have adverse effects. Please note this. That's why I'm going to guide you on the prescription at the end of this particular content. That is why it is very important that you, you, and you watch this content to the end don't skip any track because you may go and because the vita you have had vita leaf you go and pan warm trailer load of vita leaf and give your chicken and you see a, an adverse reaction you say this man didn't tell you that's why it's necessary that you watch to the end don't skip any track now let me break down in pieces before i now go into the quantity and quality you need now it, the mineral aspects mineral content of cedar acuta leaf in poultry cedar acuta leaf commonly known as bitter leaf or onubu in Igbo land of nigeria contains various minerals and vitamins that can be beneficial to poultry one is cashew important for bone development eggshell formation and muscle function iron content of bitter leaf is essential for formation of hemoglobin which carries oxygen in the blood. 
magnesium is very important for muscle function, nerve transmission, and energy metabolism in poultry and livestock animals. Potassium helps in maintaining fluid balance, nerve function, and muscle contractions. It has zinc, which is very essential for immune function, wound healing, and protein synthesis in livestock and all the poultry agri animals. Now, let's go into the vitamins. Vitamin aspect of this particular product is awesome. Vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, vitamin K, vitamin B6, and many others. Vitamin A alone is good for vision function and skin and feather health. Vitamin C, an antioxidant that supports the immune system and helps in the absorption of iron. Vitamin E is an antioxidant that helps to protect cells from being damaged and at the same time help them to support their immune function and immune structures to boost their immune system so that they will be able to fight on their own without any additional antibiotics to fight any diseases and infections, both bacteria, fungi, parasites and the rest of them on their own. Vitamin K is essential for blood clotting and bone health. And vitamin B6 helps in metabolism of amino acids and the production of red blood cells in poultry and livestock animals. Now, what are the medicinal value of cedar acuta? Cedar acuta or onubu or bitter leaf, whatever you call it in your own language, have antimicrobial properties earlier mentioned. Cedar acuta leaves believed to have antimicrobial effect which can help poultry fight off bacteria, fungi, and viral infections. It has anti-inflammatory properties or compounds in cedar acuta that can help to reduce inflammation in poultry, which can be beneficial in managing various health issues or health conditions in poultry. It has antioxidant properties which helps in protecting the whole poultry from oxidative stress and damage caused by free radicals. It helps digestive health, which also makes it very good to digest the feed, including promoting gut function, and at the same time, helping to alleviate digestive stress in poultry. It supports their immune system and immune structure that will help them to fight against any infection and at the same time guide their health system and resist any external, both external and internal infections. It helps in liver health, the liver health of poultry and livestock animals. See, the acute leaves are also believed to have benefits for liver health, including supporting liver function and potentially helping to detoxify the liver. Why is the acute leaves have a lot of benefits and a lot of good things. The minerals and vitamins play vital roles in overall health and well-being of the poultry and livestock animals. However, the exact content of this cedar acuta leaf is very important. Please listen and let me guide you on how to make use of it. You know that cedar acuta is planted in the bush, in the farm. Now, these particular leaves are exposed to sunlight, to dust, to air, and other things. That's why it's very important that when you pluck about 200 to 300 grams of bitter leaf, pluck, remove the stems and only collect the leaves. Wash the leaves up to two times. Squeeze out the juice either pound or blend it properly well. Squeeze out the entire juice that is bitter in nature. Remove the extracts. Keep the juice one side. The other one, you can still use it to cook your onobu soup or bitter leaf soup, which is very which is very delicious. But what we are using here is that water that you used to throw away. Now, use that water in 10 liter drinker and serve your 100 bears. If you have 500 bears, get 1 kg for 1,000 bears. 1 kg is enough for 1,000 bears per meal. Why you reserve the, the
the leaf itself, the leaf extracts for your soup. Then serve them the water. Do this for five consecutive days. Your best will be protected from red droppings, to protected from green droppings, will be protected from white minky droppings, either bacterial, fungi, parasites, viral, or any other infection. This is what this leaf will do for you. If you have any question concerning the content, please drop it on the comment section. Share this, please. As you are sharing it, God is giving you more wisdom, more knowledge. And this is the only way you can support this particular platform. You are not paying me any money. But this is the only way you can support this platform. It costs a lot of money to develop a content. And once content is developed, please make sure it reaches other farmers that are in need of it. That's the only way we can grow in this business. Because you can produce and at the same time consume. There are consumers, there are producers, and there are distributors also. This is a chain business. This is a chain formation. So we must carry one another along. That's why it's very necessary that you share this video. Drop your comments. Why I go back and I'm coming in with another interesting topic on the same organic poultry farming. Stay tuned and don't go far. Bye.